Uh, Leon, I think you've been one of the most successful artists in terms of the kind of imagery that you select, and I think you've had uh, some of the most individual successes in terms of viral images, images which have just knocked down the entire globe. Uh, yeah, I've seen that already happen. Uh, I try to focus on, um, on that kind of images which will um, uh, reflect my thoughts and also uh, has a, a very recognizable image for everybody, so in that matter it will uh, it will be also uh, shared by many, uh, I guess. I think a lot of people would have seen your Lego warriors on the internet. I know that I see that image many, many times as I'm looking through uh, three-dimensional art on the internet. Yeah, I saw. I noticed that, uh, that as soon as I made that uh, piece, like the, the Lego Terracotta Army, uh, all over Asia was uh, uh, calling out for me to come over and uh, do some 3D artwork over there. Well, as well they might. Of course, we know that nowadays there are many uh, talented Asian artists as well, so it's a little bit difficult sometimes to get back over to those countries. But um, I love the images you use. You use a lot of images of childhood images and toys, and I think that that's terrifically popular globally. What are you doing here? I'm doing a, a here a mural, a painting right now, and you can see uh, also uh, uh, dolls involved. So a little bit uh, back to the childhood again. Uh, for me, it's always very important to um, to look back at your childhood, uh, so not forget, uh, um, not to forget your inner childhood, because it's uh, uh, therefore it always has to be a playful image uh, that people can recognize, and then they can be uh, drawn back to their childhood. I think this sort of imagery is really nice for this particular area. Uh, what about uh, Dubai and JBR in particular? Do you think is um, is, is kind of the, the, a nice frame for your own work? Well, uh, well, the nicest frame you have here is the, is the good uh, weather conditions. <laughs> because I'm from Holland and uh, it's supposed to be always raining there, and so it's hard to, uh, hard to do some painting uh, there. So would you guess that the weather this week is better in Holland or better here, down here? Uh, of course, better down here, yeah. So would you, would you suggest when you go back, if you were to go back to Holland, would you suggest that people come here for vacation? Well, if they want to uh, have some uh, enjoyment and uh, some good weather, then uh, of course, yeah, we'll go here and especially go to the JBR walk because uh -huh. it's like uh, uh, everything uh, you want to have a very nice holiday. Now this year, of course, it's going to be a little difficult for you to react, uh, talk to the people because you're up on this scaffolding. But last year, of course, you were here as well, yep. and uh, you were able to talk with the people and to meet the public down here. What's your impressions about the people that you meet on the street here? Well, I'm also looking forward to uh, to next week because I'm going to make another one uh, down the down the walk, and there I'll be able to talk to the people more. And uh, I see um, a lot of progress uh, compared to last year. Uh, especially with my uh, images because it uh, has more appreciation uh, at this moment uh, to get it a little bit more edgy so uh, oh, that's, okay. that's also nice to see. Well my feeling is that the art form that we've been doing around the world is somehow particularly suited to this environment and I have some ideas about why this is but um, what, what are your ideas about why the, the illusions or the 3D pavement art is particularly suited to this the environment of JBR and of Dubai in general? Well, you can imagine that the um, people are a little bit uh, busy here with uh, uh, a lot of building activities and um, maybe that's kind of uh, related also to this kind of art form, to, to, to search for a new kind of technology in, inside the art and to be interactive with it. Well, perhaps the idea of the artist being a participant in a society that's being built, to me this is a society which is still being built and perhaps the fact that, you know, as artists, that this represents just almost an infinite amount of opportunity. Yeah, yeah, that could be right, yeah. And especially th that you're also building the artwork on the spot, that people can, can see how it, uh, how it happens, yeah.